Defender of Freedom uploading data log for Day 66 of the Galactic War. Hello, Data Archive. Today we have made significant progress in establishing them in Kent Line. Helldivers have been fighting fiercely to push back the Socialist Toasters, and we are pleased to report the first major victory on the offensive. We will start today's log on the Automaton Front. Our focus, of course, has been in Menkent and Lazoth to establish the Menkent Line, as designed by High Command. On the previous day, Helldivers focused on the liberation of Menkent, with a smaller force sent to Lazoth to establish an initial foothold. This strategy continued into Day 66, to first push the Clankers out to secure the Hydro Sector. Menkent has not been a hospitable planet to fight the bots, due to its scorching temperatures and high winds that create firestorms akin to the atmosphere on Hellmire. However, at this point in the war, Vedra and Helldivers are no strangers to adversity, with unmatched expertise against the bots, rarely making any miscalculations. Lazoth is the polar opposite to Menkent in its atmosphere with its extreme cold. This planet is covered in ice and rock. Divers familiar with the Terminate Front may see similarities in this planet to Istanum, a seemingly familiar and comfortable planet to liberate. Its icy temperatures delay heat buildup in weapons, making it an opportune location for laser weaponry. We have also received reports on testing of the new GWW Live Weather subscription service to reduce the cluster of orbital barrages to absolutely devastating results. We are pleased to report that in the opening hours of Day 67, Min Kent has been liberated and Lazoth is nearly halfway complete. Haldivers can now consolidate their attack into Lazoth to establish the Menkent line. It is prudent that Haldivers remember that these planets must be held until the end of the Major Order to ensure that our Seaf engineers have enough time to build and implement the orbital defenses as part of the Menkent line. This means that we will likely need to return to the defense of these planets following their liberation. On the Terminate front, Day 66 began with the defenses ongoing in both Crimsica and Hellmire. It seems that some of the bugs were not receptive to the spacious enclosures and nutritional supplements we created for them on our farms. A bunch of ungrateful insects. Perhaps our first iteration of the farms requires some improvements to make it less likely for an outbreak. Unfortunately, these two attacks could not be contained due to deploying the majority of our forces to establish the Menkent Line. However, the liberation of 4A Prime has been steadily rising throughout the week, and in the early hours of Day 67, it has been liberated. This concludes this data log for Day 66 Data Archive. We have liberated our first planet against the Automaton Reclamation, and will continue the fight to secure the Menkent Line. We are dropping Helldivers onto Lazoth. 